All right, we're headed back to the cave on our frog. Gonna, gonna get a dung beetle, because apparently they can pick up poop on their own and free fertilizer. Very important to have to have that for, for plants. Also collecting the drops in here is just, it's too good to not do that. We gotta, we gotta get the good shit. Best drops. Uh, let's see, it's a bit choppy in here. It's always like that for me, like when you're getting into a cave. I, I feel like it might be a bit choppier in this game, but I'm not sure. Oh, wait, this is the point we gotta go and take off all the armor, because get hit by a centipede, that all falls apart. It's no good, don't want that. Let's see, so we want, I, I think I can get anything, any dung beetle, any level. I would like a high level one though. 45, 15, 140. I can't say no to 140. Oh, I can't say no to that. All right. This, this. Gotta get this. I thought this was gonna take like a lot longer to find something good, but I guess not. I think it's you. You can feed them every 37 seconds. Um, I think it's large poop the best you can do. I, I think you might be able to do better with titanosaur poop. I can't remember. If you can, then that, that'd be difficult to get. You need like cannons and stuff to knock that out? Oh, that's not happening. Look at that. Little beetle guys. Very friendly. There we go. It's the second feed down. Oh wait, is it one of those things where the first one takes a long time and then the ones after go quick. That might be what we're doing. I don't know. Why why am I just sitting here staring at beetle ass? What colors is this guy anyway? Oh, yeah, it's, it's that first feed, that's what it is. It's that one that takes a long time and then the ones afterwards are nice and quick. I knew it wasn't crazy. Boom. You will be named... Dung Eater. As that is what you are. Let me turn off the... Follow, stop, and then we'll just bring him with us for a bit. I don't want him ending up dead though. So what we're going to do is we're going to toss him up there. And we'll pick him up once we finish our cave run. Collect. What, probably two or three drops here. I think there's two Megalanias on the ceiling there. I've just been ignoring them because they don't actually fight me. They just exist on the ceiling. As long as they're doing that, they're not a problem to me. Oh, damn. That's a nice horse saddle. I can't believe I'm looking at like a 200 saddle and I'm thinking, oh wow, that's alright I guess. That's... Oh, I didn't see this guy. Yeah, the biggest thing that does damage to me is the uh, Arthros. I think primarily from their taking damage when you attack them.
I don't want to kill the dung beetles because they don't fight. Oh, we got a drop down there. Perfect. Yeah, since the dung beetles don't fight, I just leave them there. That way, you know, less dangerous things spawn in. Okay, how many Arthurs we got? Two? We can deal with that, no problem. No problem. Was that another spider? This frog does pretty well in the cave. Snakes are easy to deal with now. Okay. Is that all that's gonna come for me? Perfect. Nothing too interesting in there. Well, let's see, there's probably one more just around this corner, and then we can leave the cave. Yep. Come on, show me something good. That's kind of garbage compared to some of the stuff we've been getting here. But we've cleared out the drops can return with our dung beetle. Oh, he's still angry. He's an angry little beetle. Yeah. Scoop up our little guy here and run out of the cave. Okay, we're almost back to the house now. Bring this guy in. Then we'll hop onto the RG and fly back to the uh, the new house. Do I got anything in you? And yeah, we can take those. Let's take our beetle home. Yeah, I, I was thinking the, the dung beetle tame would take a lot longer, that it would be a bit more difficult, but that was way too easy. As you can see, I've been working on like a bit of a perimeter wall now. It's got like just the, the layout for it, plan for a gate there. Just kind of going around here. Some basic stuff. Keep the uh, the bigger dinosaurs safe down there. Okay, let's set this guy down. Oh, he's already full of poop. Wow, he's just picking them all up. Now, do I need to set him to wander for him to make fertilizer? I think I do. So let's just turn that on. And over time, he should make us plenty of fertilizer. And I don't think he'll be able to move because this stuff heavy. Even then, we just need to put like 10 pounds worth of garbage inside of him to stop him from moving for good. I'll just use some obsidian. There, he shouldn't move now. 
And if I'm correct, he should still pick all this up. Yeah. Alright. That's fine like that then. Alright. This yellow drop, and it's got a ring. Let's see if we get something good. Something nice. Something... Something tasty. Come on. Please be worth the... Uh, Eh, not really. I don't see anything too crazy in there. Like the goggles are nice. We can go to the water now, I guess. We'll find like a normal scuba tank. Yeah. I guess we could tame a water dinosaur if we got a scuba tank. Why not? You know, if I'm gonna be honest, I'm not really seeing anything that I want to tame right now. The best thing I saw was a good Rex. I don't have the kibble for a good Rex. So there's no point. So instead I'm just going to go for level 82. You know, grab a couple explorer notes or something. And we can make the chem bench instead. That, that'll be uh, what we do. Figure out what we need to finish that thing. Craft it up. Then we can make all the spark powder, gunpowder, narcotics, all of it. So easy. We have so much spoiled meat. Ah, oh, he's healing. I ain't dealing with that. Alright. Let's see. Yeah, that got us a level. Chem bench. Alright. We might actually already have most of what it takes. Ooh. Alrighty. next thing we're gonna want is 89. That's gonna take a long time so we're not even gonna worry about that. Oh yeah, look at that, another alpha. Cool. Let's get this chem bench. This is big. I might actually start using the guns now. I didn't want to make any gunpowder until we had the chem bench. How many electronics can we make? That's going to be a big limiting factor, I feel. Mmm, we're not going to have enough of those. Although... Let's see. No, that doesn't take electronics, eh? Alright, so that's where we're lacking. Put that in there. Actually, no, we'll put that in our, our proper place for it. Question is, do we have things that we can disassemble for electronics? I don't think we do, other than that. That is unfortunate. 250. Oh. Yeah, that's, that's not happening today then. But then, I, I guess I know what I'm taming now. So next time, we'll go get ourselves an itchy sore. We'll take him down to the bottom of the ocean. And we'll go into one of them caves. We'll grab silica pearls. Just like that. It'll be easy. So until then, I hope you've enjoyed. If you have, please stick around for some more. See you next time. Have a good day.